Okay, and welcome to part three of my new movie release day trip to Best Buy Super Hall three part video. Um, first part, I talked about this and Disney is releasing, and they went on a kind of a rant about, uh, you know, Disney and their home video division. Part two, I went on a a promotional type video um, where I talked about some new Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles releases. So if you want to check out part one, there's a link right here. If you want to check out part two, there's a link right here. Unlike the other previous videos, if you're just watching this now, part one and part two are already up. So there are links right here. But this is part three. And as often the case, whenever I am in any place that sells <laughs> videos, um, I have a tendency to to buy some. And because I was going there for two specific videos, I looked around and that was the problem. You see, as Nathan and the Blu-ray Anonymous group should, well, I don't know that he's covered it yet, but uh, one of the steps to recovery uh, from your Blu-ray addiction has to be get in and get out whatever you're going in for you get it and you leave do not linger do not look around because if you do you buy stuff so why did I buy things well see currently MGM is they're having sales all over the place and they had a display in this Best Buy with their sales, which included lots of stuff. I mean, there was probably another five I could have gotten, but all of these releases were only five dollars. All these Blu-ray releases were only five dollars. So I picked up, loving it, Chuck Norris's The Delta Force. I love this movie. Loved it growing up. Um, as you will see, it's regularly $9.99. Five dollars. Again, another Chuck Norris. This is Code of Silence. Pick that up. You'll notice that regular price there. Seventeen bucks. Five dollars. Um, picked up a, a JCVD Cyborg. Yeah, gotta love Cyborg. It's a classic JCVD. It's probably one of his better movies from that time period. Um, I believe this is regularly like eleven or twelve dollars. Five dollars. Another JCVD, this time Death Warrant. Check out the price, $13, $5. And then, see any, I think there's a slip cover for this one somewhere. So if you have, a, if you have this slip with this image on it and you don't want it, let me know because I do want it. Regularly $12 for $5, I picked up carry, but not, this is the old carry. But I picked it up because it was this this cover, um, and I I love that cover, love that cover. It's a beautiful cover. Then on my way right at the checkout, there was some stuff there, and they had two video games, clearance pricing, both at clearance price of five dollars. See this five dollar thing I'm going on. But when she rang them up in the cash, they were even discounted further. So for, I don't know, it was like something like $3.73 for the PS3 Anarchy Reigns. And for the Xbox 360 Defiance. Yes, the same Defiance that is uh, in relation to the television show that's on. Which I started watching and then missed a couple of episodes, so I kind of stopped watching but I will get caught back up on it and and get back into that so yeah don't know anything about this only know about this is being I think they are advertising when the show was on that you you could play this in conjunction with what was happening on the television sh I don't know I don't know there was some kind of promotion going on so says exclusively online. So, 
But anyways, yeah. That's what I picked up today. Way more than I planned to. But at the same time, great buys. Great buys. Yeah, this gets the great buy moniker because all of those are great buys. Can't wait to watch them. Um, let me know if you've seen these movies, um, what you think about them. If you own these releases, what you think about the release. If you don't, if you've never seen these movies and you're curious, let me know. I have no problem um, well, letting you know whether you should see them or not. Because, yes, I do realize it may seem redundant to, to say, yes, you should see them or no, you shouldn't see them, considering I just bought them. But I watch a lot of stuff that I would say don't buy, and I buy them. I mean, I, I, I buy stuff that you should never, ever buy. <laughs> but sometimes there are, there are things that you should buy, and sometimes it's a matter of opinion. And what you like and what you don't like. So, if you have any questions about anything that I just picked up, short of those video games, because that'll probably take a while to play, um, let me know. So that concludes part three of my new movie day trip to Best Buy pickup video extravaganza super haul. This one being a great buy. Again. Hopefully you uh, watched all part, all three parts. If not, go back and check them out. Um, but uh, yeah, that's it for this video and this pickup. So until next time, guys, take care. Have a good one. See you in the next video.